Hi, I was uh, having a hard time starting off my new PC from the CD-ROM. I just got a, a new Samsung uh, Windows 8. Uh, it didn't have that option at the beginning, so um, you have to uh, do some configuration right here. Uh, go into the system. So the easiest way to do that is uh, as soon as you start off your computer, as soon as you start it on, you click on F10 and that will give you that option so that's what we're going to do right now I'm going to show you real easy okay we're going I just started off my PC I click on F10 I don't have an option right here all I have is Windows Boot Manager and enter setup so I just go into enter setup I click enter then from there I choose boot I will go down to where it says OS mode selection. That's what it has right now. U E F I O S. It's got the OS right there. I go down and select U E F I and Legacy OS. I click Enter. I click OK. Now I'm going to click, it says here F10 will save and exit. As soon as I click F10 save configuration and reset. You press enter as soon as you press enter make sure you press F10 again to go back into configurations okay F10 I'm clicking on it Okay, now I got this window right here for open for options. It's not ready yet. Uh, it says Windows Boot Manager, Tachi, and, and there's my CD ROM now. You can see it. If you want to start it off from there, you can, but what we want to do is uh, go into Enter, Setup. Now we go to Boot again. Now we're, go we're going to choose Boot Device Priority. Click Enter. Now, if we were to start off our computer, it would not work because it's right now for option one. It's uh, the first one is, is touch. Now we're going to choose Windows Boot as first option. So what we're going to do? We go to option one. We click Enter. Now we choose Windows Boot Manager. Enter. See, it changed it. Now for this one, we'll go in. Option number two, if you want to leave it there, it doesn't matter, but I'm just going to choose my, my uh, CD-ROM. And then Hitachi can stay at the end. Now, I click F10. It says here F10 and save and exit. So I click F10. Save and exit. I'm going to click F10 just to verify again that, that it's in the right order. Okay, I'm clicking on F10 now. Okay, now Windows Boot Manager. Okay, that will be the first one. We're going to enter setup again. That way you can see it, how it's going to be working on your system. Boot priority you click enter now you could see that for option one it will stay on windows boot option two is the cd rom which will not work unless you uh, click f10 as soon as you start off your computer okay now we're okay now we'll just uh, click f10 again to exit okay now i want to start off from my cd rom you got insert a CD. You put a, net, a CD in there. Whichever program you want going to run. Now I press F10. Save and exit. Yes. Now I click on F10 again. Because I want to start off my CD. I want to start my computer from my CD room. Okay, 
Now I can choose my CD. I pressed enter. Now it's uh, working. Okay. So I got this uh, signal device uh, CD which uh, gives me the passwords I want to start off my computer. It will show all this. But so let's start uploading uh, everything will be okay let's take a little bit I'm just showing you as a demo that it will start off from your CD There you go. That's my option right here. I got this program now working. I'm just gonna go to. Uh, and the easiest way to work uh, uh, this program, you just go into Splash. You click Enter, and then uh, you just press. Uh, this little thing will pop up. You press OK, and then you just click Scan, and it will scan the area. Okay, that's another thing here. It's going to go to reboot. Okay. Reboot. Killing the process. Okay, remember my CD is still in there. Now the PC is going to restart again. I'm not clicking on anything. Just so you see that, that it is working. Now it will start working normally. Still trying to work the CD because <laughs> it's in there, but it won't capture it. Okay, so there it is, and now I just uh, put in my password. Okay, just show you it's working there it is so your PC is working normally well I hope this video was good for you and it's pretty easy okay thank you have a great day or night or whatever it is